Hey guys, welcome to the weekly reading for Taurus. I hope you guys are all doing well. Sending you love and light always, as usual. This will be a general collective reading, so this will not resonate with all of you. Please take what resonates and leave the rest, but this could resonate with you if you have placements in your birth chart in Taurus, or you're dealing with somebody that does have Taurus birth chart placements. Please take a moment to read through the description box, especially if it is your first time here. I would appreciate that. And welcome to my channel if it is your first time here. Personal readings are closed, guys, but um, don't forget to like and follow me on Instagram and Facebook if you're interested in collective readings. All right. Taurus. Taurus. You hear my son playing. All right. Somebody needs to make a decision. Somebody needs to make up their mind about something. I feel like they don't feel like they can make up their mind right now or they feel blocked. They're not doing it. They don't feel like they can see things clearly here. Somebody's trying to figure out what's going to make them happy or what's going to be fulfilling for them. It's like... Mm. somebody is married here somebody is in a relationship somebody could still be holding on some either somebody is holding back from having it's like they know that they want this they know that being with you being married to you being in a relationship with you coming into union would make them happy but they it's like they just they want to take like they're still thinking about it they're taking a pause here they're holding back from having this new beginning with you another storyline here somebody could still be holding on to the mother of their children or the father of their children all right, possible signs here. We have um, Scorpio energy here. We have Pisces energy. We have Taurus energy here. Um, you guys could also be holding back from a person at this time. Um, we have Earth, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Somebody's returning here because they have regrets. Somebody's going to be returning here. Somebody that walked away emo emotionally withdrew from this situation. They're going to be returning because they regret that. They regret maybe not telling you the truth or not communicating something to you. They don't, they don't feel like they were able to see things clearly and they went in the wrong direction. Yeah, they, they made a wrong choice or they went in the wrong direction. This is somebody maybe not able, feeling that they can trust their own judgment. All right. Um, somebody wants to bring in some a stable offer here or offer you something stable here and they want to... Somebody was maybe... They're, they're wanting to reveal something to you or it's like... There's a return here. Somebody that ghosted you, left you out in the cold. They're wanting to come back here, heal this situation. If you guys broke up, they're wanting you to get back together. But I don't see this coming together. There's something toxic here. An addiction. Somebody's just toxic. An obsession. Yeah, and it's like, I don't know. I feel like it's faded for something toxic here to come to an end. Whether that's you and this person, like Spirit can be saying that you and this person aren't meant to come together or there's something else that this somebody is holding on to that is toxic, that is fated to come to an end here. If they're in a, if somebody's in a union already, I see that coming to an end and it doesn't look like it's going to end very well either. Yeah. Yeah. I do see somebody rushing in with some type of communication once they're free from some type of commitment. They're secretly working on something here. Mm. All right, let's get some more details. Secretly working on something.
somebody's watching the other on social media observing whoever it is that they're interested in they're observing them keeping tabs on them you could have somebody blocked but they're still able to watch you somehow especially if you guys have something that's like um out in the open or out in the public like you guys have a business you guys have like a youtube channel something that you guys do your instagram famous i don't know what it is but there's something here um they're still able to watch you and it's maybe because you guys are like um you guys put yourself out there hmm It's like somebody is watching you get attention. They're watching you get attention or recognition, gain popularity. They see that a lot of people look up to you. And it's like they feel like your relationship is dying here. Somebody feels like there's a relationship coming to an end here or that's dying. Or they don't feel like, they, they feel like their chance of being with you is dwindling here. Hmm. I see somebody, what does this have to do with this? What's the second T card? Clarify second T. Somebody needs to be careful who they're listening to. They're getting advice or they're, they're gossiping with somebody and the information that they're receiving is not true. All right, somebody needs to, somebody's lying. They're faking something here. So somebody needs to be careful who they're listening to. This is somebody that maybe like they they like pose as somebody that's very supportive, encouraging, but this and it's like this person's trying too hard and it's like there's there's a fake person around you. There's somebody fake around you or around somebody somebody that like tried to like act like they had somebody's best interest at hand, but it was like actually this person was faking it. Yeah, trying to make yourself look big better. Things are not as they appear. Sugar-coated truth. Yeah, somebody was lying or, or uh, embellishing, all right? Or they just weren't who they... Who, somebody isn't who you think they are or this person that's coming through in your energy, they're finding out that somebody that they thought was for them isn't, okay? Um, yeah, it's like they're finding out that somebody doesn't really care about them. I also feel like somebody's getting a lot of criticism for like maybe something that they're doing. They're getting a lot of criticism and but they don't care. They're try or it's like they get a lot of criticism. They don't really care. They're trying to make themselves look better for something that they're doing here. It's like this is almost a situation of like somebody did something dirty to you. They're going on Facebook trying to get pity from other people and they're like getting a lot of compliments and encouraging getting support from people but this person's a drama queen or a drama king they're they're trying to get attention like this person actually did something shady and they're trying to get pity for it like they're it's like they're playing the victim that's what this is yep somebody's playing the victim and it could be like it's because you're walking away somebody's walking away from somebody and somebody's playing victim trying to make them look bad or trying to make you look bad but like this person wasn't even really putting in they were breadcrumbing you, but now that you're actually dismissing them or you don't care, you're walking away from them. Now they want to blast you out, you know, try to get pity and uh, make themselves look like a victim. When this person was playing mind games with you or they had other options, they were being non-committal. Ooh, I don't like this energy. Yeah, and it's like you're done, you're walking away now, and now this person wants to try to get pity. They're maybe like posting on social media, trying to make you look like a bad guy. Yeah. I feel like the divine is supporting you and walking away from a situation or whoever this is, they're supporting this person and walking away from this situation because this situation they have outgrown. Yeah. Somebody was very resistant to walking away from something, but I feel like somebody's finally going to make the decision to do so. And somebody's not going to be too happy about that. All right. They're going to, it's like somebody was not making the decision to marry another person, to commit to another person. Um, and I feel like somebody is going to be walking away now because they're tired of waiting. They're tired of being breadcrumbed and Whoever they're walking away from is going to try to make them look like a bad guy. All right. Um, 
Yeah, it's like you're detaching from someone, put on blast. I told you, put on blast. It's like, you're, somebody maybe is going to tell you like, hey, so-and-so is talking about you on Facebook or online somewhere. Like, this person's going to try to put you on blast. But Spirit's saying, don't, you need to really think before you reply to that or engage in that, okay? You may even want to just completely ignore this person, at, at, period. Yeah, I feel like you're going to be very frustrated that this person is trying to make you out as a bad guy. Like it's gonna be very, you're gonna be very annoyed. It's gonna be rough because this person's gonna be trying to put you on blast. They're gonna try to make you look like a bad person. They may even put your your personal business out there because they're mad that you're walking away from them. But yeah, I see you guys like coming back. You're gonna like, I see you guys. This may turn into a fight. I see you guys clapping back at this person. You're not gonna let this person walk on you or uh, trash you online. It's like I see, yeah, I see like a back and forth argument or discussion Ugh. but it's like maybe this is like something here where you hmm, what is this it's like somebody's feeling pressure it be this could be somebody else this could be somebody this could be I'm seeing here that somebody's going to be feeling like they're caught in the middle. So this could be you fighting with somebody else that's like maybe related to this person. Somebody's going to feel like they're like caught in the middle. They don't know who to side with or it's like they feel like they have loyalty to two different people. I see there being some type of conflict, somebody being put on blast online. Spirit saying be very careful or really think before you say things. All right. Um, somebody's going to feel like they're caught, caught between two situations. Cause maybe you have loyalty to two different people. Like there's like, there's going to be like some type of conflict here and you're in the middle of it. Like this could be you getting into a conflict with their other, like their other person, like this person that's coming through in your reading, they, this could be you fighting with their other person or something's happening here. Somebody feels pressure to make a decision or a choice between two people because it's like, but they feel like they have loyalty to two people. Somebody is trying to reel the other person in. It's like somebody's trying to reel another person in. Hmm. Somebody's trying to do something sneaky or in a slick, slick way. This could all actually be talking about a situation that already played out. And it could be saying that this person is going to be trying to come back and try to make things right with you. But this person is just not a good person. They they they're very selfish. They will do anything and any anything and everything to win and to come out on top. That is in their best interest. They don't care about what how they what they do affects other people. There's going to be some type of conflict here. Somebody's going to feel caught in the middle. All right, let's ask this. Where do my um Tor where does Taurus stand in this situation? Where does Taurus stand in this situation? Canceled. Yeah, you guys are dismissing somebody. You're rejecting them. You're not interested. Somebody's going to feel some type of way because you're not interested in them anymore. They're going to feel rejected. They're not going to be happy that you are dismissed. Like you're going to be getting into a fight with somebody that like you guys both know, or there's going to be some type of disagreement with, with about with somebody's going to feel caught in the middle. Somebody is not going to like that. You're going to be going out on your own. But I feel like you're going to be blessed if you do this. All right. But yeah, somebody's going to be mad because you're canceling them. And I feel like there's going to be other people involved. It's going to be kind of a mess. All right. So this is what I have for you guys. I hope that this reading resonated with you. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you could take something from this reading. Personal readings are closed, guys. But don't forget to like and follow me on Instagram and Facebook um, if you're interested in collective readings. But other than that, guys, I hope you have a good rest of your day and I will talk to you soon. Bye.